Hi there, it's Mike here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're playing in the Beef Head 75 on my main account here. I've gone all the way up to the uh, the tier 10 on this line and uh, stopped at the Beef Head 75. So I'm in terrible trouble with it. It's it's, it's it's not a bad tank to be fair. I've, I've come back, I've been playing it quite a little bit here and um, just trying to go up on this ridge and see if we can get some shots in at the Tortoise. It can do some nice damage, it's just unfortunately you can't get the purchase on this hill. Unbelievable. Shame the 75 was there because I could have come around that side, but fortunately he stole that position. I'm going to leave him to it, I think. Um, Standard B's gone round over there. I'm going to go around the back. t 54 is coming this way as well. But uh, I'm going to go around and, and go either through the middle or, or around the side, depending on what happens. Where the guys spot them, it looks like they're all over the left hand side there looking out the map. We've got all our meds bagged up. <laughs> Don't know what they're doing really. A couple of TD meds. Um, we've only got one. Oh, we've got a four. Yeah, we've got four thousand and five there. But uh, certainly not going where we want them to go. Can we get a shine on the tortoise from here? Don't think we can. Lost the tank already. The M103 is there. Type 61 is there. I was wondering which is the best place for me to go. I can see the 103's come up to the hill. I think I'm going to go up and help out at the top there. The Jag EPZ E100. Can we get a shot in? He was around there somewhere. I'm going to put a blind shot in there. Come on. Yeah, he's maybe not there still. But uh, he definitely was there and he's spotting me now. So you never know. Might have hit him with that one. Don't think we did though. I'll try and go up and help out on this hill. Even it back up to 6 all, although standard B is not looking healthy. We've got the 4005 with his 4 shell clip sat on the top of the hill there. He'd be much better off in a TBD position really, rather than hiding. Um, shooting the guys up in by the meds, but, but the meds are down there where he should be, so... It's all over the shop today. Let's try and put a nice shot in. I've tried to switch to HD on the Type 61. Didn't quite do that much damage. Still having difficulty working out what shells to use with this tank. It, uh, it can work nicely on some of the meds and lights if you get it, but sometimes it's a really disappointing amounts of damage. So we need to get a shot on that uh, hammer there. Nice roll for him. Bounce from on the turret as well. That's got quite a bit of a bouncy turret. Just try and focus on the 183 if we can. Cost the 4005 as locking my shot, thanks mate. Yeah, we'll get a shot on the Jag. Oh, there. Finished him off on a 773. So even at a 4-3 actually, we've done well there. 4005 is obviously reloading. Presumably it's going to get out of the way of the hammer. No, it's not. He's reloading, sat waiting for the hammer to come. That means we can put one shot on him. One more and he's gone. 651. Guy's over there. I'm going to go and push in. I'm still on full HP. It's going and uh, hopefully he might, I might have to take a shot for it, but certainly stop him from falling off the back of the uh, bridge is what he's going to do. He's managed to get that shot there, but uh, we managed to take him back down. He was going to drop just off the edge, wasn't he? It's a cram wagon and type 68. It's two kills on the board, three minutes left. We've got <laughs> we've got a bit of a, a tall tall. Uh, Tall job here, we're on 1657 HP. We've got 2.6k damage. Cramp on it, I can, was looking very healthy. I don't think he'd even taken a hit, a hit or something. Let's see if we can use, <coughs> use the cover of this ledge here to try and get some shots in. I don't know. I don't have a look. They're going to be coming this way. I feel they know where, where I am. So they're definitely going to be coming through. Can I get some shots through the valley here? No, they're not there. They must be coming this way though, surely. Let's pop back out again. Let's try and be patient. They're definitely going to be coming. I feel they are anyway. No, not there. There we go. Get a shot. Can we go out of the way of bounced one? That's nice. Nice 620 on him. It's evened up the scores a little bit there. 1469. Wait, look at that gun reload. It takes eons. Brown Swan taking another shot, 735, that's it. Now he's, he's, within a, he's within a one shot, if we can repeat that uh, 
Repeat that shell there, uh, we'll be doing all right. Can we just get out of the way? I wonder, can I get a shot through this sneaky little hole here? Oh, should have done the HE shell on him. Should have tried that. That would have been a perfect, perfect time to put a HE on him. We'll have to go around. He's going to come around the back, so I'm going to have to go and face the cram bag and need a high roll here. Oh, we didn't get it. Seven one four. He's not going to be able to finish many of those. He didn't manage to damage me. One more. Oh, he's just taking me down to one. <laughs> He's out of shells out, there we go, we can go forward as long as we don't miss this one here. And then we run out of shells, we've got two, two AP shells left. Um, there is the Type 68, he's on 514. Oh, if only I'd have hit him with that HE shell earlier, this could have been a glorious mastery. 4718, it's going to go right down to the last shell here. He's definitely going to be coming up that way. I wonder if we can get a high roll. We'll try a heat shell and see if we can get a high roll on him underneath his tank. Go around the back. Give ourselves a bit of distance from him. I don't know where he's going to go. He could have gone around the left. It's only 34 seconds left, though. It's all do or die. Nothing left. Nothing ventured. Nothing gained. We want to go for a win here. We don't want to draw. So let's hope he comes forward. He's come forward. We are three. He managed to get the pen. Pen me there, didn't he? He didn't need a lot on me. Probably fired HE on me. So team dependent, unfortunately. I could have done better though. That HE shell earlier would have given me the victory there, I think. Um, 5018 damage, 1620 blocked. <laughs> a nice finish in the end, 31k, 6 grade credits, lost as well. Such a team dependent tank, it's, it's quite good fun, but uh, just a little bit of faster reload uh, or something slightly different with the, with the, the gun, and it wouldn't be pretty awesome actually but uh there we have it a, a defeat unfortunately hope you enjoyed it here we are back in the bt 75 playing on new bear this time going over to look at the bridge on this side we've got the team has kind of split and gone towards sea we're not playing supremacy though so i'm expecting people to come this way the bridge is pretty good to take control of on this map. It's got some good firing positions going across the map. If you take control of it, all of our guys have gone in there. We are obviously it's tier 10, there's three tier 9s here. We've got a couple of tunes as well. So the clan event is on. Both sides of the team don't know who they are. We've got a couple of E100s in a tune on one side, and uh, we've got Chieftain Mark 6 and a Jag PZ E100. Looks like our team are taking it to them down the middle. Shaking it about a bit. We'll try and get some shots down the side here. Put some damage to that E75. Shot into him 610. It's got a really lovely heavy hitting gun, <laughs> the PZ 75. It's just the amount of time it takes to reload. It's, it's eons. You could basically go to the shopping, get a cup of coffee. You know, go to the toilet and, and still wouldn't have loaded. It's uh, it's probably the longest, longest loading guns in the game. It's uh, it feels like it takes eons. We've got another big hit on him there. Seems not looking good though. Six versus four. Those two E100s are basically ploughing through the opposition. We've got no chance, I don't think. But we can try and get some damage in. Got a nice shot on the FV4005 there. Not a lot left life left. We've got two guys up on the hill. The E75, surely she can go around him. We've got quite a bit of HP, but the problem is they've got five tanks and those E100s are both <laughs> looking like they've got full health, aren't they? That a bit taken off them, but not not enough to uh, to write home about the E75. Bit oblivious. But yeah, the E100s are going up to take on that. TL7120 we've got up on the bridge. We've got Conway as well. It's one platoon left. The grill is here. I wonder if we can get a nice HE shell onto him. I wonder if he's got the spot line or on. Bounced a shot there nicely. Let's see if we can get 359. He's obviously got the spot liner. Do the next one. Let's see if we can get by it. Again, we've bounced another one. Surprising. He's not aiming there. He's not aiming very well because he can definitely pen me. Just go back to normal AP. 
Much more effective, 765. Should have done that with first. HG, HG never works, is it? I always get, I always get, uh, get a bad rap from HG. It's uh, three versus two. TNZ has come plowing through. Put a big shot onto him. He's going to go right down to the wire. He's going to get a shot on me there, though. Surely we can finish him off with his last. Go here. The E100s are coming around the corner. I'm going to have to go around. The, I don't know. Can't go. I'm going to have to hope he takes, takes him there. No, he's gone, as not he? Should have maybe taken the shot at the rear. Could have finished him off, possibly, but it's only going one way now. Got. I wonder if we can get another shell out. Don't think we can. Possibly. E1, good. No, he's going to take me out before I go around the corner. No, I managed to get around. Can they get a shot off? Don't think I can. No, I can. It's not, it's not quite that way for some reason. <laughs> But there we go, 5.6k 5, 5 damage and uh, a defeat. It's just too team dependent, this this tank, unfortunately. It is uh, it's a rail. It's, it's quite good fun to play. We played it a bit in uh, Skirmish and the gun can really deal some damage to uh, to those meds and lights. And anybody, actually, you know, you do a good 1,000 damage, 1,100 uh, to the back of a batch I said It's always fun to do. But uh, it's just really too dependent. Very difficult to win in unless the team are playing with you. Hope you enjoyed it. Anyway, this is Mike over and out.